I am Raquel, I am a construction manager and I am living in Fumba Town in Zanzibar. It's a nice community, uh, you get along with different uh, people, different cultures and uh, there is always things to do so it's, it's quite fun. So what are those uh, special amenities or what, what is different about Fumba Town? Because you, you, you're telling me you decided to come and you even relocated completely and uh, you're coming from Spain. So what's special about Fumba Town compared to Spain? Well, basically, well, in Fumba Town and in Zanzibar is, is the weather, you know. Yeah. Uh, uh, in Madrid we have like summer seasons and, and cold seasons, uh, winter seasons, and here through the year you have like from 20 degrees to 35 degrees, so we don't have like kind of like winter. Yeah. And uh, then we enjoy really Zanzibar and Tanzania, uh, there is a lot of variety. You, you can go to mountains, you can go to beach, you can go to everywhere cities. Apart from the houses, um, what else is there to do here? What, what else are you enjoying? What are the amenities you're enjoying here? Because my stay here, I felt like it's more like a community compared to a, a tourist destination. So maybe you can, what's your opinion? On that. Well, I'm, I mean, they are not only doing uh, housing, it's like proper community building. So uh, there is like places, so we have supermarkets, we have restaurants, uh, we have ATM, we have uh, shops, we have uh, co-working spaces, we have a medical doctor, a hospital. So um, apart from, from the houses, they are potentially building also uh, shops and other amenities that they, they like there is a lot of people who really like uh, to get an investment here the the return is actually really really nice depends what is your target you can find different options there is like the family places and then there is this kind of like investment so you can have this variety in uh, to have a choice of you know which kind of house you want. This is more like compound to live. Uh, they are promoting more the long-term rentals yes. than the short-term rentals. Of course, there is short-term rentals everywhere, but uh, it's more long-term based. The price per square meter is not uh, really bad if you look to other kind of investments, and uh, you cannot go wrong with twenty thousand dollars. You know, <laughs> you can find your small studio for twenty thousand dollars, thirty thousand dollars. And um, it's not bad in that sense, and then uh, it will allow you to have really good neighbors, <laughs> and different neighbors, different surroundings, and yes. then you know uh, have a piece of Zanzibar. <laughs>
natural lighting. You don't even need to turn on the lights during the day. This is the balcony, very, very, very huge. So the owner of this place decided to continue with the African cultural heritage and did a very nice sitting area right here. You just relax here and enjoy the breeze and the environment. Before we get to the bedroom, we have this space right here where you can put your washing machine here and your laundry detergents and all that or you can decorate it the way you like right so we have here the entryway you can even put shoes there then now we have the bathroom so the bathroom is right here and it has been divided with this glass so this is the washroom side and the bathroom side now let me show you this cozy bedroom yeah here we are so this is the bedroom and it can fit a five by six comfortably and as you can see the owner has still done an amazing job in this bedroom we have very big windows to bring you enough natural lighting so if you're interested in either the Che Che apartments that are starting from 44,000 USD or you're interested in these Mwangani apartments starting from 67,000 USD you can always reach us through the number on your screen we will help you purchase these apartments